Hello and welcome to this short video about the exciting new Yippie.io Kubernetes mode. Kubernetes is a powerful and robust alternative to Docker Compose and Swarm for orchestrating containerized apps, but it's much more complex to implement. Yippie.io has always been able to export your apps as valid deployable Kubernetes files but used a Docker Compose based application model so you could only import Compose v2 and v3 configuration files and configure native Compose objects and properties. The new Kubernetes mode available now in open beta makes those limitations and the complexity of configuring a Kubernetes app a thing of the past. Use Kubernetes mode 2 Import existing Kubernetes applications from .yml or .tgz configuration files or create new Kubernetes applications from scratch. Once an imported or new Kubernetes application is open in the EPIO Visual Modeler, new controls allow you to create native Kubernetes objects like Stateful set and deployment controllers, at first, there are more to follow. Services, containers, and persistent volume claim, persistent volume claim template, and empty dir volumes. As with other applications, when an object is selected in the canvas, its properties appear in the properties zone to the right. Your Kubernetes mode application can be exported as Kubernetes OpenShift or Helm configuration files. A Kubernetes mode application cannot be converted to a Compose-based application. Never fear, you can still import, create and modify your Compose-based applications using Compatible mode. You can also create a Kubernetes mode version of any Compatible mode application using the fork function. Kubernetes mode is available to all now in open beta. No need to sign up, just log in to Yippie.io and start modeling. Thanks for taking the time to watch. I hope this was useful and that you'll log in and try Kubernetes mode. Thanks again for watching. Goodbye.